How's it going, guys? You guys are fantastic. Thanks. Thank you. So uh, it's, this is exciting. CMA week, very different this year than every other. Um, and I'm really excited for you guys in particular because the amount of, uh, of music and following that you have this year, of course, vocal group of the year, you guys are going to take that home hands down. Hands down. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> What's happening over there? He's a little hungover and he's having some struggles. Can you plug this in for me? You know what I love? I love paying compliments and, and that's, that's why. So as we're as we're watching tonight and you guys accept the award, how do you decide who actually will uh, will be the one uh, that like do you write the acceptance speech? Do you ever do that when you're nominated? No, no, we never write anything or uh, probably should. <laughs> <laughs> These days you don't get any time to say anything anyway. I know. It's just like credits start rolling the second you talk you start talking. Yeah. Yeah. Do, do you look at that, though, or do you kind of just like blow through and say, you know what, there's people that I wasn't able to thank before, but then I can step up? I think it's, you know, it's really tough when you're up there and you're not reading something. It is tough to remember everybody. We just have to be sure that we that we personally thank the people that we love and have gotten us here, you know, off the stage. You know, we just get up there and start a jumble of things start coming out but you know eventually sure. afterwards we just go and make sure we face to face thank the people that are responsible for helping us get here for sure and i think this is the third award show that i know uh we've had a chance to talk beforehand and i always say to you guys hey i'm putting it out there if there's a charity that's near and dear to your heart i will donate my paycheck if you say cowabunga up there <laughs> so oh, just yeah. think about it Stick right. it in your head, and I. What charity do you guys have? One that you all come together that you love? Um, there's a there's a number of them, but we always end up, you know, on the St. Jude, um, you know, charity events, and you know, we we love that place. So yeah, so yeah, we could we could work a cow bunga in. Just just think <laughs> about it, and, and we're uh, we're getting closer and closer to the holidays. If there's a uh, a positive light of what 2020 has brought to everybody. Cause I think like we need that, you know, coming together for this country. What's something that inspired you guys to actually look and go, you know what? 2020 is not as bad as everybody is making it seem. Like, do you have any uh, inspiration for them? I mean, you know, one silver line, you know, you just look for silver linings. So obviously, you know, for us personally, I can just speak to what we've had personally. Uh, we've gotten a lot more time to spend with our kids, you know, We've been go, go, go for the last however many number of years. So it's just getting a chance to slow down and, and spend some of that quality time is, is one silver lining. Yeah. And, and the last quick question, because I know you guys uh, got to wrap. Alex Trebek, uh, who we've been following his story for a while, he passed away in the country music community. If there was somebody to step up in the next hosting role of Jeopardy, who would that be? Blake Shelton probably would be oh, really nice. good. Yeah. 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 Who out of you guys would would be the best? If one of the- <laughs> I feel like Jeff would kill it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Jeff has the like right amount of like, just kind of he can just really go for the monotone, calm, yeah. and uh, you know really make people feel like they're stupid for not getting <laughs> yes. the right answer, <laughs> but not know that he's doing it. So yeah, it wouldn't be really hard like- for him to like act. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Uh, it's what is pizza. <laughs> I love all of it. I, I appreciate you guys very much. Know that we're always rooting for you, and uh, tonight's going to be a great night. We're really excited. The CMA Awards, the pre-show party. Thanks so much for your time tonight. Appreciate it, man. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.